this the area with the ghost leviathan? Because we might be in trouble. Uh, well, it's one of the areas with the ghost leviathan. The juvenile ghost leviathan, apparently. Oh god, it's right there. Okay, well, just fucking kill me now, why don't you? Oh god, I think it's- I think it's gonna- Oh shit, I think it- it's definitely gonna- Oh god! I'm just gonna stay over here! Oh, watching that thing come out of its mouth is so creepy! Just gonna stay here. <laughs> Far away. There's diamond there. You know what? I feel like I should probably grab that. Welcome aboard, Captain. Look at you doing backflips and shit. You think you're cool? Oh god. I am very nervous. Oh shh. Okay. if it was coming for me i think it, maybe it's going for the river prowler for all the aneurysm i don't freaking know oh god damn it go grapple shit oh uh! okay we're good i think maybe i don't know god damn it yo okay we're going the right way I'm finally gonna get to show you guys my favorite biome in the game. Not biome, my favorite area. It's technically in the, it's technically in this biome, but it looks almost nothing like this biome, and it's awesome. And we're gonna see it together right now. You guys ready to see this? Look at that. Oh, I've been waiting to come back here the entire playthrough, guys. And now we're here. Look at it. <sighs> guys, we're breaking 900 meters. And this is the giant cove tree. Unless they've changed its name, which they might have. But... There's only one way to find out. Oh my god. First things first. Uh, screenshot! <laughs> and secondly, we're gonna go up to it. And see, these, like, egg-looking things, I have no idea what they are. Okay, it's still called the Giant Cove Tree. And the, the ghost ray seemed to like it. Can I take a sample? And will they... No, I can't take a sample. That sucks. Back to Abyss Walker! I love this area. Look at that. It's so gorgeous. It's actually the background on my phone. <laughs> like, let me, let me pull it up real quick. And pause so I don't waste stuff. You can see it, kinda? The giant cove tree? It's the background on my phone. So, yeah. It's... I love this area. Okay, let's read about it now. A vast tree encountered in a deep cove, and the only one of its kind encountered on the planet. There's only one of these things. The tree is surrounded by rays grazing on its pink outer leaves. A hardy, fast-growing bark covers the outside of the tree. Minuscule organisms inhabit the notches in the surface. Oh, is that what those are? The tree's branches are wrapped around a number of maturing eggs belonging to the species designated Ghost Leviathan. Okay, well that answers that mystery. I have no idea if those were eggs or what was in them. I had no idea. Now we know. Awesome! There's at least three or four more of these. Looks like there's about three. That's fucking swell. The tree appears to be an ancient nesting ground. The eggs were laid when the tree was young, and now the branches protect and grow with them as they await the right conditions to hatch. I kind of don't want to hang around here anymore. <laughs> Any longer than I have to. Is there anything under here? More deposits. I suppose I should look for some more nickel while I'm here. Also, I don't know if the blue stuff is toxic. Probably is, going my luck. Maybe on my way out I'll grab some more nickel. Oh, jeez. Oh, 
god, am I nervous, guys. Oh, hey! Singular nickel deposits! That's something new! That's the first time I've seen one of those. That would have been nice to have back when I came down here for nickel the first time. You assholes. I'll take silver. I need to make at least two more wiring kits so the more silver I have, the better. Can you grab it? Thank you. Oh, hello. What the fuck? Oh, wait a minute. I don't recognize this. What is this? You know what? Fuck it, I'll grab it. Until I, until I need to get rid of something, I'll just pick up whatever I see, right? Oh, please don't tell me there's another ghost in here, because that would be unfortunate for me. Can you- Ah! These deep shrooms are the worst. Yeah. This is definitely it. I'm at 80% power. But that's fine, because I have- I have the thermal upgrade for the prawn suit, do I not? I- I crafted that, right? Or did I not? I need kyanite for that. Shit, I need kyanite for that. But that's fine! That's fine. I have the means to get it. There we go. You guys ready? No turning back now! Oh crap. Okay, hold on. Everything's fine, just give me a second. I'll pick up a gel sack. Again, don't really know what I need that for, but I'll grab it. I should also probably grab more ruby. I've been kind of neglecting to grab ruby, and I feel like that's probably a bad idea. Oh, pick it up. Please pick it up. Thank you. Okay. Oh, God. Guys, shit's about to get real. Like, really real. Oh, that ambience is definitely different. I don't like this. I don't really want to pick up any more gold. Yeah, guys. Uh-huh. I just realized we broke a thousand meters on that drop. We are- oh, fuck you. We are past one kilometer below the surface. Yeah, like I said, uh, the- oh no, not you! I remember you! Oh, I hate these things! Oh, this is gonna suck. I forgot about these things. Shit. Going down. Mr. Warper, I would appreciate it if you would fuck off. Warpers are really hard to dodge in the prawn suit, and I hate it. Okay, we're looking for kyanite. Giant deposits of blue crystal looking things. That's what we're looking for. <sighs> we're about to meet another leviathan. It's one that I personal. oh god. It's one that I have personally contended with in the past. Hello, Mr. Lava Lizard, I remember you. I don't have my stasis rifle with me, which is unfortunate, but I will scan you anyway. Let's read about the Lava Lizard! Medium-sized predator adapted for life in volcanic regions and remarkably, ow, capable to spit molten rock at its foes. I was unaware of that, and that sucks. Designed to do maximum damage to prey, sharp internal teeth tear through flesh and bone alike. Likely scar tissue, likely due to regular exposure to magma, lava lizards build up a thick layer of scar tissue over time, which enables them to withstand even greater temperatures inside and out. Its behavior is able to both defend itself by burying its body in magma and to go on the offensive by spitting molten rock at its foes. Avoid, especially in the presence of lava flow. Oh, good. Okay, then. Oh my god. Yeah, he really hurts. I'm actually surprised I didn't get warped just then. This area looks so different. There's so much new looking... God, I thought I heard it. So much more new looking stuff. What's this? diamond. I'll grab it, I guess. It's a good thing I have that reinforced dive suit, because now I can withstand temperatures outside of vehicles, too. Uh, high, high temperatures, that is. I can't talk. I'm excited and terrified and just really nervous at the same time. Why am I not seeing kyanite anywhere? I'm so fucking nervous. I have a spare power cell, in case I run out, which is, which is fine! And especially because of those little assholes right there, our life is going to get so much harder if I let one of them get close to me. Oh, that's the wrong button. Jesus Christ. Okay, come on. You've been preparing all game for this. I haven't seen any Kyanite, and that makes me... 
That makes me so nervous. Getting the Cyclops down here without getting any of those douches near you is, I mean, it might as well be impossible. Ah! Oh, that's kind of, I, I see it! That's really big, actually. Oh, hello, Lava Ray! I remember you! Beeline to the Kyanite. Oh, wait, let's go for this one. I don't want to be up. I, I don't want to be out exposed on a thing. My god. The Kyanite is, like, in completely different places now. You fucker. Stay away! I'm busy! Stay away! Please don't. I hope that meant it left. And see, it automatically adds it to my storage when I drill large deposits. Which did not used to be a thing, by the way. <laughs> you used to have to drill it and then get out and collect it all by hand. Which is super cool that they that made it so you didn't have to do that anymore. Oh shit. I know what that was. Well, I'm gonna have to deal with that in a second. Hold on. Excuse me. Get the fuck off. Uh-oh. That's probably bad. No! Go away! Okay, up here. I don't like being up here, but we'll do it anyway. You know, it would be hard enough down here without the warpers. Like, are you kidding me? Okay. Maybe I'll do one more deposit and then head back. Just check that there's none of those stupid suckers on me. I'll try and scan stuff before we head back, but I mean, for now, I'm really just trying not to die. Ooh, yeah, it said to avoid that, so I'm just gonna. You guys definitely did not used to do that. That's probably not good, right? Okay, I'm gonna drill here and just hope nothing bothers me. God damn it. Anyone want to come mess with this? Huh? That actually made me shit my pants when I turned around and hit that, but whatever. <laughs> nervous! Do I look nervous? Because <laughs> if so, it's because I'm nervous. I have a lot of kyanite, and I'm gonna have to come back down here, so you know what? I'm gonna cut my losses and go home. Fuck it. Maybe I'll scan a couple more creatures before we go. I'll scan you. I started scanning you, so I guess I'll scan you. Excuse me. Piss off! You sound scary. Maybe scan one of these douches. One of the little guys. I'm pretty sure they can't hurt me. Lava Larva. That's right. That's what you're called. I just called you a little sucker because that's exactly what you are. You piece of shit! A grub-like species which appears to lack sight and smell, but is able to sense and drain thermal and electrical energy in its immediate environment. Yeah, if they get on your vehicle, and they will, multiple at a time, they drain your power. It sucks. Capable of attaching to smooth surfaces and generating high-pressure suction, will release if it comes under sufficient strain, smacking it with a knife. Thick scales protect from extreme temperatures. The lava larva lacks a traditional digestive system. Instead, it powers its internal processes directly from the energy it consumes. Weird. Attached to energy sources of all kinds, draws energy from its prey to survive. Mm -hmm. Avoid when piloting vehicles. Remove to conserve batteries. Yes. That's a thing that it does, and it sucks. Boomerang fish. New creature discovered. Magmarang. That's cool. I can't read about it, apparently, because I didn't scan it. It's still weird. Magmarang? <laughs> That's got a nice ring to it. I can't think. I'm focusing. I'm trying not to die, okay? I'm gonna make at least one more pressure compensator for both the Cyclops and the prawn suit, if not both for the prawn suit and the Cyclops. Oh, fuck no! Swim away! Swim away! Fucking asshole! Oh god 
damn it, I don't know where he is. I'm scared. I don't know where the way out is. I just know it's way up and ah, uh, fuck! Keep going! That's the ceiling! Ow! Go faster. Do not let it catch you. Okay, he's all the way over there. Ah! Uh, I don't know where I'm going! And I don't know why- Oh crap, I'm out of thrusters! I wouldn't land in lava. <laughs> oh god, it is. Okay, it is. This is back to the- this is back to the cove tree. Which feels infinitely less beautiful and less safe because, you know, ghost leviathan eggs in tree. <sighs> Man, that thruster upgrade helps tremendously. I'm stuck in shrooms now. Okay. Hey guys. God, I feel so safe with these guys around. These are like the reef backs of the deep. When I see them, I'm like, hey guys. Like, cause they, they avoid predators, right? So there's just, they're everywhere up down here and it's, it's awesome. When I get back to the Lost River, I'm gonna collect a bunch more, uh, you know, uh, what's the word? Nickel. And then we'll head home. This is the area of the game I know the least about, because this is right around the time I stopped playing the beta version. Until version 1.0 hit. Like, a year and a half to, you know, almost two years ago. So, this is where things are the most unfamiliar. Including the Cyclops, and the Lava Zone, which I don't even recognize anymore, down there. And once we get to this this third facility third facility it's the third yeah uh the last time i was in that third facility it was unfinished so i don't know what's gonna be in there i don't know what's gonna be different and i'm really nervous about that <laughs> nothing except nickel nothing but nickel reginald you're all the way down here are you oh god it's toxic i forgot ow 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 okay Where's my prawn suit? Shit. Get in, get in, get in, get in. Don't freeze. Get in. Thank you. I'm still being poisoned. Ow. Okay, that was a mistake. Whoops. I had more storage space than I thought. And never mind. <laughs> it's fine. Oh my god, why do I keep doing that? I am so dumb. I am so dumb. Why do I keep doing that? I'm such an idiot. Okay, hold on. Jesus fucking Christ. Why am I so dumb? The fact that that thing is a baby is just, like, so unfortunate. <laughs> and even the, uh, the, the PDA for the adult in the crater said that the adult that you just scanned was nearing maximum size. So that's still... Not the biggest it can get. Holy fucking shit. Fuck yeah. Oh god, yep, that was probably a bad time to take a picture, but you know, photographer gotta take risks to get to get the money shot, you know? Oh shit! Money shot was worth it! Okay, he's not wearing anywhere near me, we're fine. We're totally cool, everything's fine. Heading back to Poseidon. No! Oh, thank God. Okay, you actually gave it to me. I don't know how I managed to do that because the frame rate was so terrible. But okay, I need to clear out some space here. Where am I going to put this? I don't know how my power is doing. My engine's been off, so I hope that means the power hasn't been draining while it's been sitting here. If so, that would suck. I think it has. That's unfortunate. Damn, son. Okay, hold on. But I do have a spare power cell in uh, in my Abyss Walker, so I'm just going to use that for the Cyclops in case of emergency. Screw it. 0, zero 58. Oh my god, we're in such bad shape right now. We are in such bad shape right now. But okay, it's time to head out of here. I'm not entirely sure how, but it's time to head out of here. Can I at least turn it before turning the engine on? I can't. Let's find the way out of here. It's... It's behind me, isn't it? 
Yeah, okay. It's directly behind me. I just gotta turn around. I steer I read Connor Tower on the top of the screen. I'm sorry. My mind went there. Can you blame me? <laughs> God damn, dude. There's like this this freaking Cyclops has like no power efficiency. It's the worst. Arg, my life. Okay, you know what? This this fucking sucks. And there isn't enough heat byproduct. You know what? Fuck it. I'm not. I'm gonna stop fucking around. I'm just gonna go home. Powering up. Engine powering up. Screw this. I'm going home. <laughs>